everybody, Martika here with Martika J Makes. If this is your first time joining, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back. You guys, here it is. Sewing High End on a Budget 2023. This has been highly requested throughout the year and here it is. This is a three-part series and this is part one that I am bringing to you today. But before we jump in, let's just talk about how this got started with me personally. Well, we know that when we see on television and magazines and books and the whole nine yards, we see celebrities with fashion that inspires so many others you guys but what we don't realize is that this inspires pattern designers we have pattern designers that inspire celebrity stylists and then we have fashion that inspires the everyday person like you and me especially those of us who sew so if you are watching this you do not know how to sew i can probably guess that this will definitely inspire you to learn how to sew but let's be real especially in today's world who can really afford the price tags on these designer pieces when you don't make designer money, seriously. Now, I'm not saying that these pieces are not worth the price, and I will get into a little bit more detail as I show you a few of these things today. However, when you know how to sew, you can replicate it, customize it, and make it yours. You too can look like a celebrity from your own sewing machine, you guys. We don't fake it until we make it. We see it, and we sew it and in the process we save a lot of money so let's get into it first up we have a piece from Cynthia Rowley now if you sew you have seen many of her patterns in the simplicity line and she also has her own designer line and this is one of those pieces it is a geometric turtleneck top you guys however the price tag for this is $225. Now, this is a cute top and all, but I know I will probably will not even if I had it paid $225 for this piece. Now, that's just me personally when I say these types of things, especially when I can sew it. So, I went through looking for what I could uh, use to pair up with this to see what would look good and you guys I found two patterns that would go with this because when I look at this I'm like that is really smooth going into the jeans and it looks like as you move it stays in place so this says that it is a turtleneck top but in my mind could it be a bodysuit because a bodysuit can definitely help you stay, help it stay in place like that. So I look for two bodysuit patterns, which was uh, to give you an option here. And I did find New Look 6752 and Simplicity 8513. Now, one thing about the designer top that I did notice is that if you notice at the top of the neck part of it, there is like a purple uh, fabric piece there so I was thinking well it could be lined within the turtleneck itself and allow you know basically allowed to show uh, it could be just sewn at the top I don't know I couldn't get a close enough look at it but if you use your imagination and you sew I could easily see just placing a piece of uh, contrasting solid color fabric or even a print if you wanted to underneath that to uh, a to whatever uh, pattern you're sewing, you're sewing, and just just to kind of get this look, so to speak. Now I have seen very many uh, geometric uh, fabrics out there that is very close to this, if not an exact replica. So if you take your time, you look around, and you're trying to find something that looks like this, if you like this, just keep looking, and I promise you, you will most likely find it. So let's move on to the second pattern. So the second pattern that I pulled up is a Michael Kors and this is a Kaya cashmere turtleneck dress. You guys, I thought this was really, really cute. However, at $990, um, yeah, if I didn't know how to sew, it would be really cute sitting on that rack, okay? And then not only that, but I gave you two in this one because we also have a St. Laurent long dress in knit that is priced at two 
$2,990. Yeah, you see that right. Take a closer look for this beautiful knit dress. Now you guys to get this look for that first one that Michael Kors dress, I could easily see like a rib knit fabric for that one, but that second one that St. Laurent uh dress, I could easily see like a satiny looking or a shiny spandex fabric to uh give it that really smooth look like that. And the pattern that I found for this one was McCall's 7999. And if you just take a really close look, you probably already have this pattern just like I do, you guys. <laughs> so, as you can see for that first dress, you can definitely change up the sleeves, do the first of uh, that shorter view that's in this pattern, or you could cut it to wherever you want it to be. But in that red dress on the pattern piece, you guys, I'm telling you, that is, to me, that St. Laurent dress, okay? I, I don't think you need to change anything on it except for whatever fabric you are going to, to sew up on that. That would even look beautiful in a, in a long rib knit, if you ask me. So, if that doesn't wake you up, I don't know what will. Because, as we know, when these patterns go on sale at Joann's, we can get these patterns for $1.99 and you pay what you want to for the fabric and still save money. So, let's move on to the third dress that I found. And this is not all about dresses, but um, yeah, this is, this is just another one that I found. And this is a Prabal Grung Stretch Crepe twist front midi dress and the price tag on this is $995 you guys how many times have we seen these twist front dresses in the pattern world and the twist front tops and things like that is just in style right now so the pattern that I chose to go to because there are a couple of them that I could have went to but I chose this one and it is McCall's 8339 you guys you have that V in the front if you want to do kind of like that uh, peeped open back you can or you can just follow this pattern and just uh, close it all up it really does doesn't matter but you can definitely uh, replicate this look you guys you can if you want to find a stretch crepe fabric you can do that if you want to change up the fabric you can do that too you guys this pattern is not only so common right now but it is also pretty simple to sew a lot of people would look at that and think that that twist front is very difficult to sew it is not it is very very easy to follow the instructions on uh this particular pattern so yeah you can save yourself quite a bit of money and not have to pay that price tag of 9.95 now like i said i'm not saying that these are not worth it i'm just saying that I cannot pay these prices <laughs> and if you can that is your business and because of the fabrics this is what put a lot of these high price tags on these um, on these particular fashions and then also of course the designer name comes with it too but I just take more pride in designing my own so if you haven't already definitely like this video subscribe if you have not and turn on those notifications as we move on to the next piece of fashion and you guys this one is for the men I was asked if I would put in some men's pieces the next time that I do this and believe me not only in this video but in the next couple of videos that's coming up you will see some more men's fashions you guys but this fourth one this is a sebastian cruz couture line and this is a black oro versailles dinner jacket now why did i choose this well because new year's is coming up and you might want to sew yourself up a, tux a tuxedo jacket or something like that just get really snazzy for your new year's eve party however this is on sale right now at this particular site because I scoured several different websites to see what I could find out there. But in this website, it was on sale for $797.50. Regular price on this, and you are saving quite a bit, is $1,595. Okay, so 
if you are a man watching or if you are a woman watching want to sew something for your husband or your son or your brother your uncle your father whoever you can just go and pick up simplicity 8899 for a dollar 99 if it's on sale this week or if you already have this in your stash or you could even pay the tag price on the pattern and still save a ton of money okay all you are looking for is the right fabric now it looks like uh to me when i look closer at this that there is like uh, a vest that kind of is a different cut of a vest from the top of it that i could see but that is your choice what to put under it we're talking about the jacket and you guys this would be gorgeous in like a beautiful brocade fabric to get that uh look that in embroidered look that you see in this particular um uh photo here i it, it's a it's a nice jacket i am not gonna lie this thing is nice you're gonna have to buy a couple of different types of fabric if you want to do this but you guys you can save a whole lot of money and i'm telling you you're whoever you are sewing this for even if you're sewing it for yourself there is nobody in the room that's going to have a jacket like yours. So we're going to move on to the last piece of this segment. And we are talking about this Dries Van Noten jacket. Okay. Now this is like a regular, you know, kind of what we would call like your bomber jacket uh, or whatever, you know, just and this one is like one that not only men wear but women wear these types of jackets too and you know it's just a lightweight jacket great for this time of year especially if temperatures are going up and down in your area like they are in mine however i just i personally just can't stomach the eighteen hundred and eighty dollar price tag on this jacket you guys and you tell me if you can. Now, it didn't give a lot of detail, and I don't know what this jacket is made from. I don't know if they weaved together the fabric themselves, or I don't know what they did. But, yeah, I'm going to need more for $1,880. I'm just not going to lie to you, okay? They're, yeah, I'm going to just leave it there. However, I found a pattern, and there are several patterns that you can get this exact same look from if that's what you're going for but i found mccall's 7637 you guys not only can you change up the fabrics but this is a unisex pattern so you can do this for the girls you can do this for the guys you can do this as you can see in camouflage you can do this like in a quilted pattern you can do this in so many different types of fabrics and then you can go and get the striped bands just like you see in not only the fashion photo but in the pattern itself and you can put this thing together you guys especially if you pick this pattern up for a dollar 99 get your fabric when you get patterns like this you guys you can usually kind of splurge on fabrics if you choose to but if you are shopping at the right place at the right time and using coupons and things like that or gift cards for your fabrics you can save so much money but i can about guarantee you that for this jacket you can most likely save a whopping uh eight hundred eight one thousand eight hundred and thirty dollars okay so and that's giving you even a little bit more for the fabric itself because this is just too common it's just too common to not only sew but it's even common to just go and buy too if, if need be but i had to show you this because you know, we need to be inspired by the things that we can put together ourselves and customize it to where nobody else will have what we have. So guys, as you know, when it comes to sewing, we are in our own lane and we can take these high end prices and we can just sew until our hearts are content and just continue to make them our own and have fun while doing it. So I hope that you have enjoyed part one of Sewing High End on a Budget 2023. Be looking for part two because it will be coming up. And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments what you think. Have a great one, you guys, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.